Hey Mima fam and welcome back to your darling channel. And today we are opening the lid on the new normal in a post-COVID-19 world. Working from home and rightly so, you are probably involved. Remember that time you wore pajama bottoms to a video call? It seemed like a harmless decision, right? After all, who would notice? Don't worry, we've all been there. It's one of those quirky perks of working from home that we all secretly enjoy. Working from home, or WFH, promised a blissful blend of comfort and productivity. The idea of rolling out of bed and starting your workday in your favorite cozy spot was a dream come true for many. But sometimes, the lines get blurry. The boundaries between personal and professional spaces start to fade. The kitchen morphs into a conference room, with your dining table doubling as your desk. The couch becomes a co-worker, offering both comfort and distraction. And suddenly, you're living in your office, not working from it. The distinction between work hours and personal time becomes a blur. This new normal can be amazing. The freedom to design your workspace and the flexibility to manage your time are unparalleled. No commute, flexible hours. These are the perks that make WFH so appealing, but it also takes strategy. Setting boundaries is crucial to maintaining a healthy work-life balance. Without boundaries, work-life balance can vanish faster than snacks in a team meeting. It's easy to let work spill into your personal time. Trust me, I've learned this the hard way. The initial excitement can quickly turn into burnout if you're not careful. This isn't about rigid rules. It's about finding what works best for you and your unique situation. It's about creating a sustainable, happy, and productive WFH life. A space where you can thrive both professionally and personally. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a newbie navigating this new world, we're here to help you thrive. There are tips and tricks that can make this transition smoother. So grab your coffee or tea or kombucha, no judgment here. And let's dive in. Together, we'll explore how to make the most of this new way of working, ensuring that your home office becomes a place of productivity and joy. Sweatpants to supercharge how moving your body boosts your work. Let's be real, comfy clothes are a perk of WFH life. There's nothing quite like the feeling of working in your favorite pair of sweatpants or that cozy hoodie. It's one of the small joys that make working from home so appealing. But sometimes those sweatpants feel a little too literal. You might find yourself sinking into the comfort a bit too much, leading to a sluggish feeling that can impact your productivity. That's where movement comes in. Incorporating physical activity into your day can be a game changer. I'm not talking about marathon training. Unless that's your thing, then go for it. You don't need to commit to hours of intense exercise to see benefits. Even small bursts of activity can make a huge difference. Just a few minutes of movement can elevate your mood and increase your energy levels. A brisk walk around the block, a quick yoga session. These small activities can break up the monotony of sitting at your desk all day. Maybe even a dance party with your pet, no judging. It's all about finding what makes you feel good and gets your blood pumping. Exercise boosts energy, sharpens focus, and helps manage stress. When you move your body, you're not just benefiting your physical health, but your mental health as well. Think of it this way. A short workout is like hitting the refresh button on your workday. It can help clear your mind and give you a fresh perspective on the tasks at hand. And a clear, energized mind is a productive one. So get moving. Whether it's a few stretches, a quick jog, or some light weightlifting, find what works for you. Your brain and your to-do list will thank you. By incorporating regular movement into your routine, you'll find yourself more focused, less stressed, and ready to tackle whatever comes your way. Friends indeed, staying connected in a socially distant world. Remember water cooler chats and spontaneous coffee breaks? WFH life can feel isolating, but fear not, social butterflies. Maintaining connections is totally doable. Schedule regular video calls with colleagues, friends, and family. Join online communities related to your interests. And when it's safe, prioritize those face-to-face -face meetups. Remember, humans are social creatures. We crave connection. It's good for our well-being and our sanity. So reach out, stay connected, and keep those social muscles flexed. Be our social butterfly here too on Mima. Hit that like button if you enjoy what we are cooking so far and engage with us in the comments. I am waiting for you. Dress for the home office you deserve. 
because appearances matter even on Zoom. Yes, those sweatpants are calling, but hear me out. While comfort is key, striking a balance between comfort and professionalism can make a huge difference. Creating a presentable workspace and maintaining your appearance can do wonders for your mindset. It's not just about looking good for others, but also about feeling good for yourself. It doesn't have to be fancy. A simple, functional setup can be just as effective. A tidy desk, a houseplant, and a clutter-free environment can help you stay focused and productive. Maybe even a spritz of your favorite fragrance. Scents can have a powerful impact on your mood and energy levels. These small touches can create a sense of professionalism and boost your mood. When your workspace feels inviting, you're more likely to enjoy your work. And when you feel good, you work better. Productivity often follows a positive mindset. Plus, you never know when a surprise video call might pop up. Being prepared means you can confidently turn on your camera at a moment's notice. Adjusting your lighting and camera angles can also make a big difference. Good lighting can enhance your appearance and make you look more professional. A smile goes a long way. It shows you're engaged and approachable, even through a screen. Don't forget to take breaks. A quick coffee break can refresh your mind and keep you energized throughout the day. Stretching and moving around can also help maintain your energy levels and prevent fatigue. At the end of the day, take a few minutes to organize your desk. A clean workspace can set a positive tone for the next day. Remember, a little effort in your appearance and workspace can go a long way in making your work from home experience more enjoyable and productive. Mind Matters, Taming the Work from Home Mental Jungle. WFH life can be a mental marathon. The lines between work and personal time blur, and it's easy to feel like you're always on. But taking care of your mental health is non-negotiable. Set boundaries create a dedicated workspace and stick to it. Schedule breaks throughout your day and don't feel guilty about prioritizing self-care. Remember, a healthy mind is a productive mind. So take those breaks, recharge your batteries and watch your productivity soar. Finding your flow hacks for a productive home office. Distractions lurking everywhere, kids, pets, that never ending laundry pile. Yep, WFH life can throw some curveballs. The key is to create a space and routine that work for you. This might mean setting boundaries with family members, investing in noise-canceling headphones, or using time management techniques like the Pomodoro method. Experiment, find what works best for you and watch your productivity skyrocket. Unplugging in a plugged-in world, the art of the digital detox. When your home is your office, it can feel like work is always just a click away. This is a recipe for burnout. Make a conscious effort to unplug. Set boundaries around work hours. Turn off notifications outside of those times. And resist the urge to check your email during dinner. Remember y'all, you deserve a break. Disconnecting allows you to recharge, reconnect with yourself and loved ones, and return to work feeling refreshed and focused. You've been a good Sharing is caring. Paying it forward with work from home wisdom. WFH veterans, you know the drill. Remember the early days of navigating this new world? Share your wisdom with those new to the game. Offer tips on setting boundaries, staying connected, and maintaining a healthy work-life balance. A little guidance can go a long way in helping others thrive in their WFH journey. Side Hustle Superstar, turning your passions into profits. WFH Life offers flexibility and freedom. Why not use that to your advantage? Explore those passions you've always wanted to pursue. Maybe it's writing, photography, crafting, or coaching. Whatever it is, there are countless online platforms and resources to help you monetize your skills. Who knows, that side hustle could even turn into your next big adventure. The final word, embracing the work from home adventure. Working from home is an adventure full of perks and challenges. By prioritizing your well-being, setting boundaries, and staying connected, you can create a sustainable and fulfilling WFH life. So embrace the flexibility, design a workspace that inspires you, and get ready to thrive in your new office, even if it's just a few steps from your bed. If this video inspires you, give it a thumbs up. 
And if working from home is your thing or you blend it with your nine to five, subscribe to Mima channel. You will be getting loads of productivity and self-improvement tips from us. Till next time, bye.